Hey guys, this is Gina. I just want to talk about self-care and mental wellness during the holiday season, uh, during this change from tradition. It's difficult. I know it is. Uh, I've experienced it and maybe a lot of you all have too, but just in different ways. You know, sometimes we have people that we love move away from us and we have to adapt to that. Sometimes people um, leave us by way of uh, death and we have to adapt to that. I know I had to. I lost my baby, my 23-year-old son, August 2018. And I don't know. It was really the holidays came and I didn't even really know if I wanted to do the holidays, but I still had uh, other children and I had grandchildren. So I couldn't just really like stop, you know what I mean? So what I did was realize that this is new change. I have to adapt to it and we have to do it this season too. You know, the p pandemic is what it is and we have to uh, practice uh, a new way of celebrating uh, the holidays this year, 2020. And guess what? It's okay. Hard times and bad times don't last always. So what can you do? What can I do uh, to make sure that we are in a better place than in, instead of succumbing to depression uh, or anything else that's not conducive to a healthy mind, body, and soul. Make a dinner for you, uh, a dinner for one. I, I went out and got me, um, my husband has to work, so I got a couple of Cornish hens, a couple of bundles of collard greens, some sweet potatoes, uh, just a few, you know. And to be honest with you, I know everybody likes to hustle and bustle of these uh, holidays, but the pressure is off me like for the first time, and I can't remember. But Mel Bob been cooking Thanksgiving for so long that I think there's going to be a welcome change this year to just do like a small meal, even challenge myself to see if that's possible. But yeah, so make yourself a meal uh, for one or for two, and watch your favorite uh, movie, uh, Zoom a couple of people and tell them Happy Thanksgiving, you're thinking about them. Um, and then plan to do the same thing uh, for Christmas. It's okay, like we're gonna get through this, you know, but you have to make the best of it. You have to keep yourself mentally and physically well. Uh, get up in the morning, take you a nice hot bath before you clean and, and cook and prepare your meal. Once you get your meal, pour you a glass of wine or whatever you like to drink. Uh, watch a good movie. Settle in with shopping online. <laughs> you know, and make it a good day because everything is what we make it to be. So if we set our minds to it, it's going to be okay, you know. It's okay. I lost my baby. I'm okay, you know. Uh, I, have, I have to live my life. Life has to go on. It's just me being me. So, like, again, um, I'm a new YouTuber. I like to bring a lot of content to you. I try to do it every day. So, please, uh, like, share, and subscribe. I'll be talking a lot because I talk a lot. This took me a long time to... Do I couldn't believe as outgoing as I am. I was so fearful of starting my YouTube channel. But you're going to hear a lot from me, even if I only have one. I think I got six subscribers, which is really good. I had one video before this. But I'm excited about this new journey. Uh, maybe you should get start your YouTube. Everybody has something to say. Everybody has something to talk about. Trust and believe. I like to hear your story, too. So tune in. Check me out. Like, subscribe, share. Your girl, Gina, from Being Me, Being Me Boutique. I'll tell you more about that later. Happy holidays.